watching this video all right so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna simple walk you through it and show you exactly how to make this fantastic an amazing drink all right lovely and also delicious um yeah so right now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna show you exactly as you can see in the title what i put what i'm going to be using is only two secret recipe and ingredients which i'm going to be using to make this beautiful drink tonight all right it's going to be one of those quick recipe it's not going to be long it's going to be a very quick one all right so let's tune in with chef ricardo all right nice one so right over here I have the bitter hood, right? This is the bitter hood, which I'm gonna be using. I did a video on it last night, and this morning I make another one off of it because I'm drinking it for three days straight, all right? I'm going to be detoxing my body with bitter hood, okay? Right over here, I have some fantastic and amazing, this is some cloves, which I normally use. So I'm going to mix cloves with bitter hood today, all right? What I'm gonna do, I'm going to put it into this glass that the guys can see so if you get one little piece of a bitter hood like this right here this is all you need you're gonna put it straight into the glass and what you want to do right to be honest with you guys with the cloves it is amazing you want to get a few cloves right here just like this we're gonna put one two three for five cloves all right once you put in the cloves then what you want to do you want to pour some hot water into the cup like this all right if you like what you can also do you can use a little bit of a sh um, sweetener or if you like use organic honey you can use organic honey but normally I would just drink it natural like that all right because of me then what you want to do next you want to put something over it and you want to leave it for a good few minutes all right guys then you're going to drink it but in the meantime what i'm going to do as i can see i have my right here my cup i'm going to put just a little piece in my cup just like this and then now what i'm going to do i'm going to put a few cloves inside of my cup like this all right and then i'm going to pour some hot water like this all right and then I'm going to cover it and leave it for it to go on for about five minutes all right after five minutes we're going to drink it all right guys but to be honest with you is a very simple recipe but to be honest we all know that bitter hood is very 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 good for you and I would encourage you guys if you get the chance to get some of this little thing right here bitter hood but this is a dry one but also in jamaica you can get the green one when they catch it fresh from the bush you know what i mean that's the best one to use but this one right here is just the one which i have and i'm going to be using this one but i will encourage you guys to drink this and give your body cleanse your blood and cleanse your body and this have a lot of antiseptic all right so guys i'm going to tell you this yeah this right here, cloves, is very, very good for you, all right? It is a very, a lot of people doesn't know, but if you go and you do your own research about cloves, see there, C-L-O-V-E-S, I'm using it all the cloves, all right? They also have the powder one, which you can also use. But I would encourage you guys to drink a cup of tea like this before you go to your bed. Won't take nothing from you, all right? And it's very good for you to go to your bed and drink something very healthy to clean and detox your body overnight when you are sleeping. And that's the best time to drink this kind of drink. All right. You might as a chef Ricardo, why are you making this kind of tea every night? Why are you keep drinking fizzy juice every day? Why are you keep drinking or eating certain kind of food every day? We all know we have to eat certain kind of food. Yes. But also you have to look after your body also all right if your sink is black with grease 
you have to put gym cleaner in your sink all right to clear your sink is it is not different from your body it's the same thing you got a lot of people when they go to the toilet they can't even poo the poo is too hard because you know why they do not take the time to detox their body and get some fiber into their body and look after their self all right guys you you have to look after yourself how are you going to do it <laughs> you know what i mean that's the thing how are you going to do it you know it's going to the gym and pushing up the whole heap of weight and being exercising that's not it guys you have to is what you put inside of your body will show outside okay just like a new car when you buy a brand new car you can see it it is a new car it's the same thing with your body anything you put in the inside will show on the outside all right guys so let's cut the story short right now let's look what's going on over here so what we're gonna do i'm gonna remove this lid all right and as i can see it for yourself that's the way it look all right you can strain it and you can just drink it as it is right there all right it's up to you whatever you want to do but this is the way oh, it looks right there all right guys it's a beautiful one and it's fantastic and amazing and i will encourage you to give this one a try at home all right and to be honest you can get the bitter hood to buy at a local shop or your supermarket and it is um, not the bitter hood the cloves you can get cloves to buy at your local shop or your supermarket with the bitter hood i think you have to do your own research on the bitter hood to get the fresh one guys but to be honest it is fantastic and an amazing all right it's a beautiful one And you guys definitely will love it all right as I can see it for yourself very very nice and also delicious right there all right so if you like the recipe as I said please tell a friend and a friend tell a friend all right now this one right here I'm gonna be drinking this one tonight um, when I was making mine last night, I put too much bitter hood into it. So that was a little bit very, very strong. But the, secret, the thing I want to say to you, you know, when I drink mine last night, I went straight to the loo. That's what happened to me last night. I went straight to the loo. And every t I f this morning when I wake up, I feel light like a feather. And to be honest with you guys, during the day when you're on, you know, we all work, some people work in banks, some people work in a mechanic shop, some people work in store, supermarket, office, whatever. And sometimes you, you don't get the chance to make certain kind of food, all right, we don't like to make healthy food. So that's why I say to you sometimes when I'm doing my healthy drink or my bedtime drink, this come in really handy for you guys. If you're a person who are interested, trust me, this is really really good for you and i will encourage you to give this a try this can help to cleanse the blood help to cleanse your body help to detox your body help to flush out your body help to put get rid of the bad detoxing in your body just like your sink if your sink is black you have to put drain cleaner it's not different from your body it's the same thing you want to flush your body you have to eat some healthy stuff and flush out the bad toxin out of your body so you know what i mean sometimes you eat chips sometimes you eat fries sometimes you eat all sorts of stuff oily food and all these things so basically sometimes guys it is very important for you to drink something to cleanse out the blood cleanse out the body you know what i mean and get yourself renewed all right but as you can see for yourself right here this is fantastic and an amazing drink And it's a bedtime drink. You do not have to drink it. I'm not forcing anyone. I'm not holding anyone. I say you need to drink this. You can go make your food, do whatever you want to do. But I'm just simply saying to you, this is my ideas for you guys. If you are with Chef Ricardo, um, yeah, try this recipe at home. Now, this is a Caribbean fusion sauce and spice tropical right here, which I've been using. And to be honest, very, 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 very delicious. And I will encourage you, if you want to try this one, get this one from the Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spice website. 
and this is amazing all right i would encourage you guys if you can get this one the link will be in the description box where you can go and purchase this and if you use the code chef ricardo you get 20 percent discount price please please support your black people business support your black people business support your black people business guys all right it doesn't take nothing to support your own black people business all right it's very nice i drink it many times and trust me and if i show you just to give you a little idea all you're gonna do is get a teaspoon of it and put it straight inside of your cup like this a little bit more because my one is a very tall cup all right just like that just like that yes just like that pour a little bit of water just like that just like that all right once you pour the liquid into it give it a little bit of stir and then what you want to do you want to cover it like this and you're gonna leave it for a few minutes all right now I was saying if you guys want to do a collaboration with Chef Ricardo, please follow me on Instagram and we can do a collaboration together. Instagram, Chef Ricardo cooking and we can do a collaboration. Now, the bitterhood tea, what I'm saying to you guys, I'm not going to say you have to drink your bitterhood tea. You can drink whatever kind of tea you like to drink, but you can drink like a garlic tea, which is very good for your garlic. It can help to cleanse the blood and also garlic have a lot of health benefit. Um, you know what I mean? But as I said, guys, this is just an encouragement of someone, you know what I mean? If you want to try something different, this is coming really, really on the fire. Bitter wood and the cloves together right here works really well. I drink it for two mornings straight and I can see the difference in my body. All right. Now I'm here tonight and I'm going to drink this before I go to my bed. The bitter wood and the cloves together when you mix them together you can drink it because the cloves have a lot of health benefit you got have i have antiseptic inside of it and it's not only that trust me cloves help to cleanse the body and cleanse the blood guys a lot of us doesn't take time to do research we go and we go and we study forget the biggest job into this world and spend thousands of pounds to get job the biggest job but we don't take time to just to do a little bit of research what we can do good for our body a lot of people doesn't do that but they will spend millions upon and go and get the most expensive job in the world and then at the same same time they will go home and they will do all sorts of different kind of food nothing wrong eating your food guys you can eat your food but i'm just simply saying it is very important for you to drink detoxing tea, detoxing water, cleanse your body. Just like how a lot of people spend thousands of pounds and fix up their car. When your car needs an engine, oil, you will go and you will change your oil in your car. You will go and you will do your MOT. And this is what I can't understand with, pe with human being. But I just think it's our mind. A lot of people, what they do, they intend to do. They will spend thousands of pounds and go and they will fix their car. And what they do, they will walk into that chip shops down the road and they will buy that oily chips and they will eat it and they will happy. But they will never take that, 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 that chip money and say, you know what, I will buy some salad or something to detox my body and just don't do that. But to be honest with you guys, you can also treat yourself with something healthy and nice, whatever you like to. But... You must look after yourself like how you look after your car and your phone at home, all right? And how you look after your house and your pot, your plate, everything you have in your house. Same way you must look after yourself. Look after yourself. You don't have to go and eat steak, beef, and chicken to look after yourself. Right here, what I'm doing right here, this is to tell you I'm looking after myself by drinking a nice lovely detoxing tea before I go to my bed tonight very very important to detox your body and cleansing your body and that's where I am every night I've been doing this video for the last six months I've been doing this video 12 o'clock at night detox your body cleanse your body with natural ingredients 
and a lot of people may just write a lot of things in the comments box chef ricardo you can do something better you can do this you can do that but then doesn't take the time to look back and say you know what i think this is a good idea of drinking something healthy before i go to my bed at night sometime you do not do, need to do it every day all right guys you do not need to do it every single day you can do it like a few times for the week or two times for the week whatever time but as you can see guys i'm telling you right here this drink i'm telling you right here when i was a young man growing up in jamaica and i'm gonna tell you something very important i'm gonna tell you my grandmother i never forget she used to give me bitter hot tea to drink and she always said to me it is good for you my grandmother lived very long upon this planet all right bless her soul she's gone to rest in peace but she lived very long and my grandparents always told me chef ricardo um this is very good for you always drink it bitter hood but I didn't like it that time because I was young when I was growing up. Now when I get old, I recognize what my grandparents was told in me, telling me that when I was young, how should I drink this tea? And I'm sharing it with you guys today. The same message which I hear about 30 years ago. And I'm sharing it with you today again to say, give this a try at home. All right, guys? Give this a try at home. Bitterhood is very very good for you sarasi tea very good for you sour sap leaf tea very good for you all right now this is my sour sap leaf tea right here bag right here all right when i was in jamaica and i was growing up i used to have problem when i used to um when i used to eat certain kind of food i couldn't even swallow it because it burned my stomach and then I never forget my grandparents always give me this tea to drink. All right? Sour, um, sour sap leaf tea. My grandparents always give me sour sap leaf tea to drink. And I drink it for probably about a month. And from that day, about 35 to 40, 35 years now or 25 years, until this very day, I do not feel my stomach like I used to feel before. All right, guys? Trust me. A lot of people might have write a lot of things in the comments on YouTube and all that sort of stuff. But I'm telling you this. I grew up in Jamaica and I see a lot of stuff and I know a lot of things. I went to the soup, I went to the shop and I saw this one, sour sap leaf tea. And I bite and I bring on this one and I've been drinking it over the last couple of days. Sour sap leaf tea is very good for you. And some of us might have said, Chef Ricardo, oh, come on. I know a lot of people might have said, come on. But that doesn't understand because you're young now and you through your young you feel like you know what i mean you have a lot of energy but one day you will get hold and you will recognize what ricardo was talking about in 2021 the 9th of july 2021 you will remember sour sap leaf tea is very good for you if you drink this for five days straight you will see the difference in your body all right bitter wood is very good for you Alright. My source, my source leaf. This is that's how you see I have a whole pajai bush in my house in the in the kitchen right now. Only pajai leaves. And you know what I mean. This is a source source um source. Very, very good for you. Come on, people. A lot of you guys know about these things, and a lot of black people and a lot of people watch the video and I might say something. Get yourself together. Alright? Get yourself together. Get yourself some of these natural stuff that might have them in your house and drink some natural remedy and cleanse your body and look after yourself. All right? If you don't look after yourself, all you're going to look after your kids and your family and your friend them and do things in your house. You know what I mean? Cleanse your body and detox your body and, you know what I mean, move freely. You can go and do a little bit of exercise, go to your gym or whatever you want to do, but at the same time, you need to cleanse your body. All right? Blessing of soul, my right here with Chef Ricardo. Anyway, thank you, Lord, for what you provide. You know what I mean? Beautiful cup of tea tonight. Bitter wood with cloves. Give it a try. Give it a go. Come back on my YouTube channel and tell me what do you think about this drink. All right? 
I drink one cup this morning and I drink one cup last night and I'm drinking another cup tonight and I may drink another cup tomorrow morning and another cup but you don't want to do it too much you know you just want to just keep it like you know what I mean simple like this you drink it after three days and then you try something different right here I got the Cersei tea I will be making some Cersei tea in the week again ahead to make you know guys know exactly please subscribe to the YouTube channel and share some love join my youtube channel membership and share some love come on guys share some love we got 51 people watching the video come on 36 like like up the video and tell a friend and a friend tell a friend all right the reason why i did this video for members tonight because i got a lot of members who support chef ricardo and i got a member who reach out to chef ricardo and share some love and i'm telling you this guys we have some angel up on this planet and bless every one of these angel they may sit right in your house, your husband, your girlfriend, your boyfriend, whatever. They be an angel to you and you don't know. I want to say something to you tonight. Treat them the best as you can. All right. And share love and, you know what I mean, and respect. All right, guys. It's a world of love and respect and blessing. It come in different form. All right. So tonight, as you see, I'm making this beautiful cup of tea right here. I want to tell you something. They are angel around us and we don't know. So if you have someone at your house right now sitting down watching your TV, treat them the best and respect and show some love. All right, guys? But we're not going to talk about that. We're talking about bitter wood and cloves tonight and drinking a healthy cup of tea and living a healthy lifestyle. I know, Chef Ricardo, you're talking too much. But, guys, I have to explain it to you. And if you have one of those expensive iPhone, the smart one, them, it doesn't take you nothing to go and Google and type in what's the benefit of cloves or ginger or garlic, all right? And it doesn't take you nothing to go to Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spice. Go to their website. You don't, if you don't want to buy nothing, you don't have to buy. Check on these kind of healthy tea right here. And this is the way it look. All right, guys. Look at these things, guys. All right? So this looking really amazing. So I would encourage you, guys. You know what I mean? Yeah. Give it a try and give it a go. But, as I said, there's a lot of natural healthy stuff out there which can heal our body and, you know what I mean, look after ourselves. All right? We don't have to keep taking all of these um, medication and all, medicine and all that stuff, you know. It's good sometimes to use natural ingredients. All right. Secondly, if you're a person who's traveling with a lot of headache, like your head always hurt your my brain and all these things i'm gonna give you a recipe for that start to eat a lot of fish like salmon like avocado and all these things prawn start to eat a lot of that and it will get rid of your migraine and your headache and all these things now the reason why i'm gonna share that with you i used to have a lot of headache and i don't know where it come from all right and since I start to eat a lot of fish and I start to eat healthy, you see, I'm doing a lot of healthy recipes and a healthy salad and all these things. Since I start to eat such a healthy way, that headache has gone completely. All right, guys, it is gone. And I'm going to tell you this. Trust me, when you start to see your head hurting you and you're having a lot of headache, it is a sign of something coming. So check yourself. All right, guys. I give you a little bit of tips and ideas so but anyway as i said i'm not a doctor um a, you know i mean dentist or whatever you want to call him but um if you do your research you can see exactly what i'm talking about all right now someone made a listen to me right now someone made a take the time and a listen to me if you find yourself having a lot of a headache your head hurting you a lot what i want to say to you you need to start to eat a lot of avocado and salmon and eat healthy and cut out a lot of salt and sugar because what happened i remember back in the days i used to when my youtube channel i used to cook a lot of chicken beef all sort of kind of food and you know what i mean when i do my research and i say okay okay i need to jip back on certain things and start to eat a little bit more healthier now when i start to eat healthy guys when I start to eat healthy, I'm going to tell you this tonight. Since I start to eat healthy, trust me, all of those headache and heart sort of stuff is gone. Gone. 
someone is listening to me right now and I know it's gone and I'm going to tell you this tonight if you're at home and if you're not eating the way you're supposed to eat and every day you get up and eating you know what I mean sometimes we eat the same thing with the Jamaican food because the Jamaican food is good for us yes but it comes with a lot of you know what I mean damage also <laughs> to be honest so you have to be careful on the Jamaican food all right with the Jamaican food you have to mix it with a lot of healthy salad and vegetables all right you can make it like this morning I make my fry fritters as not every day I'm eating that I do it like every other couple of months I will do something like that all right and I will do a lot of healthy stuff you see I'm using salt free um seasoning all right we got the we got the carbian fusion and sauce this is one this is salt free all purpose season a lot of you guys keep saying okay i like my food taste the best i like my food taste this my dad was like 98 and she was my dad was eating a lot of salt food and he lived very long i'm telling you this things and time has changed and then putting so much chemical into the stuff them now to preserve them how are you going to put something into a into in a buckle and it's gonna last until 2030 the preserve is is to preserve it very long guys hoping in our eyes some of us are blind we are blind and I'm telling you this tonight on my YouTube channel I was looking at a product and it said 2030 on the product all right Secondly, I'm going to give you another recipe, another tips of things. Alright. Alright, just to show you exactly. Because I now I'm going to look at things, okay? And when I look at things, I look at the date and then how long they take to expire. Alright. Sometimes when you look at the date, they will say on a year, it's say 2030, 2026, or 2029. All right, this is a mixed bean right here, okay, in water. All right, now I in pro I in protein I I in fiber are protein or whatever I in fiber, okay. No adding salt. All right, this will animate it. It's this I don't know what date it makes. It makes probably two, I don't know. I don't understand the date, but I'm just gonna give you a little bit of tips and ideas. All right, when you go to the shop. Check out the date. Very important. Like this one, when you when you open a tin like this, do not use the liquid in it. Okay? What you want to do, you want to wash it off and then you use it. Any red kidney bean, anything what you're using, wash off the liquid. They are preservity to keep them long. And when you have that preservity in your stomach, what you do, it's eating you out. It's eating out your stomach. But you cannot see it. No, can you see in your stomach when you're eating food? No, you cannot see what's inside of your stomach when what's going on. Until one day, you just find yourself sick. You go to the doctor. The doctor said to you, you have to stop eat certain kind of food or eat certain kind of stuff. But I want to say to you guys, to be honest with you, it's not going to happen overnight. You have to take your time and break yourself into certain things. Okay? Is what you eat, what you put inside, is going to show on the outside, okay? So if you're putting something good inside, it will come good outside. But anyway, we have to do that another time. You know, there's a lot of talking on that one, all right? Nice, lovely cup of tea, and it's a bitter hood tea with cloves. Give it a try. And all I, all I did, guys, is put one little piece of a bitter hood like this into the cup with hot water but i'm telling you the bitter hood is so strong i can feel it in my tummy going down all right now to be honest with you guys i eat my chips sometimes because i like i have a little bit of chips and i like to have certain things and these things nothing wrong to treat yourself with something really you know what i mean <laughs> whatever you want to go to the one of these fast food place whatever 
you know my daughter she like fast food fast food places and all this stuff and i'm a chef but you know their kids yes they would burn it off you know what i mean but we know where we're growing in the age and we're getting old you know we have to start make sure no where we are okay but i'm telling you this now guys it's you know i mean my daughter would say daddy you need to eat some try it try it and i said okay <laughs> don't get me wrong i would eat my little chips now and then but not every day you know i mean you're getting up and eating the same thing but at the same time what i do i will come and i will use something to cleanse it and detox it out and that's why sometimes when i eat certain kind of food during the night i normally love to drink a cup of a tea before i go to my bed healthy cup of tea so when you're when you're laying on your rest it is working in the inside flushing out your body just like when you pour down drain cleaner in your sink when you put your drain cleaner in the sink and you leave that overnight when you come in the morning your sink is free so when you drink a cup of tea like this what happened during the night when you're sleeping that is working inside of your system and taking out the bad toxin get rid of all of those bad toxin and you know what i mean give you a nice good relaxing make your skin look different all sort of stuff you know what i mean you don't need to use any chemical on your skin the bitter hood purge your blood and your skin look different all right you might have said where can i get bitter hood to buy anyway guys i don't know where you're from where you live but if you can get this to buy buy it just type up where can i get bitter hood google it but try do not get the wrong one all right when you go to jamaica you try and get yourself some bitter hood and bring it back to where you are into some foreign country or whatever you are beautiful fantastic and an amazing drink and i will encourage you give this a try all right remember you can also get this on the Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spice website. Go right there. The link will be in the description box. Here it is. Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spice. Get it from them. All right? Them have this one. I love this one also. Loving the dream. It is also a relaxing drink. Caribbean Fusion Sauce and Spice. All right? Very, very, very good for you. Cafe free. And all stuff. It's um, very, very healthy and very good for you all right all you need is hot water a little bit of sugar brown sugar or some organic honey and mix it together and drink it guys i respect every one of you and i know someone is watching this video right now someone is watching the video might have said what this guy is talking about because you may young and you don't know what's going on in this world yet but i'm telling you we are living in a world right now the world is moving fast very 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 fast Things is moving very quickly. Things is moving so fast. And most of these things what they're doing is bare chemical, 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 chemical. Everything is chemical to preserve, to keep it longer. So what they're trying to do now, they're trying to make things longer. <laughs> that means they don't need to make that again. Okay? So, but when they put that inside of your system, what happened? It's damaging your inside and you don't see it. The reason why I want to say to you, all right if you buy a kettle and you keep boiling water in your kettle what happened tell me what happened in the kettle it's gonna bring up a descaler into the kettle all right so you have to scale your kettle to get rid of that descale inside of it it's same thing with your body it's not different it's not different guys if you keep boiling water every day in your kettle what's gonna happen all right to give you a high there, all right, even your, your top, when you keep running water into it, run, run water, just use the R. I use a kettle as an example. I'm using a kettle as an example. Go to the supermarket, buy a brand new kettle and keep boiling water for it for about two months and see what happened. You have to go and buy a descaler and descale the kettle. Because the descaler, this descaler is going to build up inside of the kettle. It's the same thing with your body. When you eat certain things, it builds up inside of your body. But you cannot see it like the kettle. But it's the inside of your body. Until it keeps build, 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 build. Until one day, you're going to say, wow, what happened to me? So guys, the only thing I can say, we are not dumb. And you know what I mean? We can learn from one another. 
I learned from a lot of chefs on YouTube and that's where I can share my idea with you tonight. I watch a lot of video on YouTube how people do stuff and I do a research and I can come back and share with my audience. All right? Look after yourself. Look after yourself. Eat healthy. Drink healthy. You know what I mean? Try your best. It's not going to happen overnight. But I'm telling you this. You are not a child or a baby. You are, I don't know who you are, but look after yourself. You know what I mean? If you don't look after yourself, you can't look after your kids. And you don't, I don't expect your baby to come and look after you. You know what I mean? You, you have to look after yourself. And then you can look after your kids. Alright? So guys, yeah. You, don't have, you do not need to drink bitter hood tea to look after yourself. Or sorcery tea. There are so many things in this world. I'm just simply saying, natural stuff works really well at home. Mm -hmm. ah, that is beautiful. I like it. And if you notice, I did not put any sugar in mine. All right. Mm -hmm. This is amazing. Mm. That is lovely. This one right here. I could just leave this right here till in the morning and I can drink this as a detoxing water in the morning and that's what I'm gonna do tomorrow morning I will do a short video on this one to show you exactly what I'm going to do all right so I'm gonna leave this right here tomorrow morning and I'm gonna drink it for a detoxing in the morning I know to be honest with you when I drink this tea it makes me sweat to tell you that it makes the difference in your body this little thing right here, this little seed, I encourage you. I've been doing this video over the last six months. And to be honest with you guys, a lot of people reach out to Chef Ricardo and said, when I look at the amount of people who reach out to me and say, Ricardo, thank you so much for the idea of the clothes where you teach us to use. It was amazing. I tried it and it makes me feel different. And you know what I mean? Guys, trust me, it works. It works. You have to have faith. Faith can move mountain. All right, beautiful one. All right, mm -hmm. all right, that's it. I want to say good night to every one of you. God bless you, and I love every one of you. Stay strong and stay healthy and look after yourself. And you know, what I mean, that's the most important thing I want to share with you tonight. And that's from Chef Ricardo for the night. And I will see you with another video next time. Bye bye.